Uh, good afternoon. It's very honor and pleasure to be here at RAA. Uh, before I make presentation as the only one Japanese participant to RAA, uh, we would like to express uh, great appreciation to uh, the help that we received uh, about the uh, recent disaster uh, uh, from all over the world. Uh, very much, thank you very much. Particularly US, uh, United States, America has uh, given us uh, uh, immediate and enormous help to, for the recovery and rescue. Okay, I hope that does, doesn't, uh... <laughs> thank you, thank you very much. I hope that doesn't count in five minutes, but uh, I'll give it a try. <laughs> because schedule is very important for MRJ. Uh, okay, program up. Uh, I'll talk about um, the green. Okay, since I only have five minutes, I'd like to <laughs> explain the most important thing first. MRJ is designed for fuel efficiency from high aspect ratio, long thin wing, small diameter fuselage, advanced aerodynamics, everything is designed for fuel efficiency. And this is the key chart. That's the fuel burn per trip and fuel burn per seat. And MRJ is more efficient, fuel efficient, as much as 20 to 30% compared to the existing airplane. That's the message number one it's gonna be a millions of dollars difference per year per aircraft. The second important message is the cabin comfort. MRJ has not made any compromise to the comfort of the passenger. And I don't want to take too much time about explaining this. Please come and visit to our booth. We have a full-size mock-up cabin come see and feel how comfortable it is so that regional airliners would be able to provide seamless customer comfort throughout from regional sector to the main line. So this is the official invitation to everybody to come to our booth to experience. Well, I only have two minutes, so I so much for the MRJ. I would like to talk a little bit about our company and the uh, program. Mitsubishi aircraft, there are so many Mitsubishis, Mitsubishi cars, Mitsubishi air conditionings, but we are Mitsubishi aircraft, invested by Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, the largest machinery companies in Japan. Um, and we have an office here in the US, in Dallas. And we have just opened up the office in Europe, in Amsterdam and we are looking for the worldwide uh, market. Our launch customer is ANA, Japanese airline, for the order of 25 MRJs. Our world, ma world market uh, launch customer is Trans-States Airlines here in the United States with the order of 100 MRJs. And we are ready to announce additional order as quick as possible. Since last year, uh, RAA, we have made a lot of progresses. And we've gone through all our uh, critical design review. We have decided to partner with the CAE and training. And also, uh, our most important partner, Pratt & Whitney, has completed the first engine to test. It's running, it's running at the West Palm Beach, Florida. I will be visiting uh, next week. I'm very much looking forward to by myself. Our first flight has not been changed, stays in 12, uh, 2012, which is uh, next year. And first re-entry service is 2014. Thank you very much. Five minutes. Thank you. Well, not to sound prejudiced, but we uh, saved the, the nicest looking one of the panel for last, uh, the female. We should have let her go first if we were proper. Uh, Svetlana Svana from Superjet International. She's the Deputy Senior Vice President of Sales.
Good afternoon, everybody. Um, it's, it's really great to be here again in the States for, uh, in this very respectful uh, event. Uh, today, I think it's extremely important uh, to introduce to you the news, which we are very proud to uh, introduce to you today, uh, about the product itself and about the development of the program. Just to remind you briefly uh, uh, what you uh, know already, uh, is that uh, this program was set up in the partnership uh, with uh, several companies because that was clear from the beginning that it will be extremely important in order to be competitive in the market in the, this century to have a support from all parts of the world. So uh, Sukhoi Seal Aircraft Company, it is a manufacturer of um, uh, SSJ-100 with a partner in Italy, which is responsible for the global um, support and um, responsible for the marketing and sales for uh, United States, uh, Europe, and Asia. Uh, as well, as I already said, that without the support from all over the world, it would be difficult to compete with a, such a great and established uh, manufacturer, manufacturers uh, therefore, we have a support of our French partner uh, doing the uh, engine and responsible for the customer support of uh, the propulsion system. To give you a little bit of update with what we has been done uh, so far and uh, update you on the achievements with respect to the certification. For the last uh, three years. We've uh, finalized the certification of this aircraft, and uh, in uh, October this year, we're going to have uh, EASA certification. As a tremendous achievement, we are very proud to introduce to you the fact that aircraft is entering into service with uh, the uh, Armenia uh, carrier, and it is really achievement when the aircraft was delivered on the 19th of April and it entered into the commercial s uh, service in two days. Uh, of course, of course, it is important to see what are going to be the results of these operations, and that was tremendous achievement from the whole team of Superjet International where we had a, for the uh, one month in operation. Uh, for today, uh, aircraft flew 105 hours with uh, 54 cycles, flight cycles. So you see this number speaks for itself, and I believe that it's uh, not just achievement for the program, it's really a uh, demonstration of the quality of the product with an uh, excellent performance and dispatch reliability for the operation in one month. So I think these uh, numbers speak for itself. Uh, we are... Uh, looking forward to introduce the second aircraft in operation uh, to Aeroflot. Uh, the delivery will be next week, and aircraft will enter into operation uh, middle of June. 